on him. Oops, he's sick. Like, Welcome back to another vloggy. This is gonna be a weekend vloggy in Charleston. Today's Friday and we're starting off our morning by going to Jibe Cycling. Our friend Reagan's teaching and meeting Ellie. These are some of the girls I met at the dinner with Gwen's at Ritual. But I'm meeting with Ellie and we're riding there. Aaron's gonna be there. Reagan's teaching. It's gonna be really fun. Let's go. We have the mini Alani. You guys like my outfit? It's um, couture. It's like tie dye. <laughs> tie dye pattern. Getting sweat. Okay, tomorrow I need to learn how to make your coffee. Okay, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Well, I'm about to do an in depth thing. I'm so excited to make it. I was hoping nobody asked to get coffee because I was like, I want to go make mine. Sorry. <laughs> but I got it though. Look at it like this. I really, really, really want to try. Max gonna try jive with me next time. I really want to. Your hair mask looks so put together. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I still have a hair mask in. It does not look like this when my hair isn't highlighted though. It looks so much worse. Yeah, you should keep doing it while you have the highlights way up. Okay, I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Okay guys, so I've mastered the best Nespresso recipe literally ever like i have not been able to do it good these past few days i've like not been looking forward to my coffee i've been doing bad but finally i got a recipe that is so good this girl i'll tag her she tagged me in it so credit to her it's the brown sugar shake and espresso and i do cold foam with pumpkin spice so let's make it together first thing you do get a mason jar brown sugar and then you do like i would say like a spoonful maybe like a little more like that much. And then over that, you brew the Starbucks blonde Nespresso pod. Brew that. Guys, I'm just in the best mood. I start off my morning with good friends. And like, just being surrounded with good people, good fun people. I'm gonna make my oats while I do it. I haven't been making the oats good either. I think I've been making them too watery. So let's do like not that much water. Then you take the cup you're gonna drink it with. You fill it with ice. Fill it with oat milk. Then a splash of this Charbonne French vanilla. Just a little bit. Then I froth that together. Then I pour this ice in here. Then you take your espresso. I don't know why I said espresso. Put the lid on. Shake, 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 shake. To get that brown sugar shake and espresso. Open it. This is the best part, everyone watch. Wow. Look at that. Now, we did too much milk. So, we have to suck some out with a straw. Not good, because it was all milk. Now we make the cold foam. Chiabani creamer. Zero sugar pumpkin spice, because it's the holidays. Broth. I finally used that creamer. This makes all the difference, it's sweet cream. Okay, maybe this is the best part when I'm... Then you put a little bit of cinnamon on top. And it's the prettiest thing ever. Guys, like you're literally lying to me right now. Like, what? Heaven, heaven. Literally, I can't think of any Starbucks I've had that's been better. Make it. I literally have to hide it so that I don't drink it all. But let's see if my oats are gonna live up to the thing. Okay, mine. I'm glad I got more oat milk at the store. I wasn't really sure if I needed it, but I did. Oh, did we do too much? Because I don't want them too watery. There's a fruit. Guys, I hope it's... Oh, no. My fruit... Oh, no. I think all my fruit melted. Oh, fork. Okay, I have an explanation for that. Okay, good, we're good. It's because I left the freezer open while we were at the farmhouse event. They're thicker today. I think the key is like, don't do too much milk or water because they'll be too watery. It's a good day, y'all. 
Hi guys, so I just want to make this one to this video dossier. If you guys don't know what they are, they are a fragrance company and I'm so obsessed with these perfumes. My favorite thing about dossier is they are sustainably made, which is incredible. They have affordable prices and they are luxury perfumes. What better three qualities could you want in a perfume? I've also been using these for a couple days and they are so long lasting. Like I feel like I've been using, the one I used was the Ambry Vanilla and seriously, People have been asking me what I've been using and like how much it costs. So I'm like, no, it's literally affordable from Dossier. Like you guys can get it. Like it's not a crazy like high price luxury brand name perfume. It's better. Like I'm so obsessed. I can't wait to try the other two because this one's the Ambry Vanilla. And I told you guys it smells so good. People literally are like, Anna, what are you wearing? I'm not kidding. Since I moved to Charleston, like multiple people have asked me and I'm like, what did I switch up? And I realized like right when I moved is when I switched up on the perfumes. This one's Gourmand White Flowers. They smell like, this smells like I'm in like a literal flower shop. I'm gonna put this one, the other one. This is floral honeysuckle. I'm super into flowery smells, but there's like clean ones, bright ones, florally ones, mainly ones. Like there's so many different options. Cinnamon, warm, holiday ones. Oh my gosh. I cannot even decide. Like, I can't wait. I need Mac to choose which one she likes best. And then this one's the one I've been wearing. They're all just so good, you guys. And they come with these little cards about... Like, the Ambry Vanilla, the one I've been wearing, is inspired by the YSL. Like, some are, like, inspired by certain luxury ones. I just think it's so cool. Like, the Flora Honeysuckle is inspired by the Gucci perfume. So, you can smell like your favorite celebrities, but on an affordable budget. And you can smell just like them. I know I'm obsessed with these, and I'm going to be using these. So, I can smell luxury without spending all my money. Because I need to be better about budgeting. You guys can, too. Go try dossiers perfumes they're super affordable and you can just feel luxurious the link is in my description to buy these dossier perfumes if you don't like it you can return it so easy but you will like it that won't even be a problem go click the link in my description to try your dossier perfume i'm obsessed and my room smells so good go do it let me know your guys's favorite um scent Okay guys, the TV looks so good. And so he stepped on one of these. He said he can pay me for it, but like it's whatever because one piece was already broken. So we're just gonna keep it like that for now and we'll see if it's under warranty or if we can get a new one. But I forgot how freaking fire it looks. Um, the vacuum is charging. We're gonna get a little thingy here and then let's go see my room. I kept these in case we have or need them for storage or something. Like, let me know if you need any storage because I don't know where to put them. Look at these shelves. Wait, I love. Isn't that so good? Yeah, he did it so good. He did. And he like asked me like two questions. I thought I could put like a couple boots on some. Oh, like, and then. I really like the boots. Like my YouTube, just like random oh God, like. The and the TV looks so good. She's really good. So cute. Dude, and when he was here, he saw that first thing he asked when he got, he goes, you do YouTube? And I was like, You're like oh. he was like, what do you do it about? And I was like, myself. <laughs> he was like, really? And I was like, yeah. <laughs> oh, and guess what? This is the best part. When 1989 comes out, the cover matches my room. Oh, perfect. So it'll go right in front of the Speak Now one just because the blue matches more than the purple. And then I was going to do like one print there, but it might be a little, we'll you might, see. You might not even need it. I know. Like, that's really pretty. I could do like just a print uh -huh. here. There'll be wallpaper there, and then... Wait, what are you doing there again? The dresser, oh, yeah. and then just decorating the dresser on top of it. Because I was debating, like, where to put this, but we didn't want it too high, and then if it was too in the corner, it would hit that, and I wanted yeah. to, to see it from bed, but I feel like that's perfect. Yep, I love it! Looks so good. The boots is such a good idea. I'm obsessed with that. Do you think they look good up there? Yeah. And, like, obviously I can order more stuff. This is just yeah. for now. And the nightstands, like, are so... Oh my god, it's so cute. It really is cute. I went from Jordans to boots. For real. I love this progression. Okay guys, I'm back. I took the boxes down, which is, look at my red arm, because it's so annoying how far. Okay, I'm being dramatic, it's not that far. But it's so far to take our pack, like your broken down boxes. It's nice because of trash, they come to pick up our trash. But boxes, you have to take to this room all the way down the parking garage. It's like one floor lower, but it's hard when you have a lot of boxes. And I carry, got my packages, and it's three big boxes I left outside. Or they're medium sized boxes, but I was like walking like this, putting my coffee, because I got coffee down in the lobby. Just a French vanilla latte. In my cup, it says, Girl, please, I'm from Woodstock. So good. Need a little 5 p.m. pick me up, because we're gonna have a night tonight. Guess who's about to come over? Ryan. 
You're correct. And then we're all gonna go either get drinks or dinner or something and then go to the Windjammer to see some of the girls we used to cheer with, one of their boyfriends forming. So I'm excited because I've never been to the Windjammer. It's like an outside concert area in Charleston. So it's gonna be a fun little Friday, but I need to shower and start like getting ready. Just dicing my hair. I'm pretty proud because it came from the shower. I use these Living Proof products. They're banished oil and they're dry. Oh fuck, I didn't mean to use the dry shampoo. I meant to use the anti-frizz. <laughs> that was in sync. Mm. Where are we? At the... Poppy's Taqueria. Poppy's Taqueria. It's a very vibe if you're going to Here the wind ladies. jammer. Thank you. Thank you. You're Everything bagel, cream cheese, and avocado. Um, yeah, and hold on. Went out with them. Hold on. Oh, these are interesting. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm Y'all, I'm in the same outfit from last night. Yeah, I like pumpkin. I love pumpkin. Pumpkin. You wouldn't like them. Pumpastic pumpkin. I'm not really big pumpkin fan, but those are good. Just. Set out of the pool, about to start our day at five. <laughs> yeah, five. We finally just got some motivation. She's in the same spot as she went. She <laughs> still hasn't eaten her bagel. No bagel in. <laughs> it is Saturday in South Carolina, but not really because we don't play. But it is a Saturday and we are in South Carolina. What flavor do y'all want? I'm gonna do witches, bro. I want this one again. Cheers. Cheers. Oh my god, that reminds me of last night a little bit too. Cause we need to take. I'll take a mom water. <laughs> 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 oh. These are the only things I got. With the what? This Alani Witches Brew flavor, so good and spooky. All right, so I haven't talked to y'all much. We had a slow start to the day. Woke up at twelve. Went to go pick up Max car and then stayed there all night. Okay. You were about to sleep on the couch right? That's With Max. Oh. Then we tanned at the pool from 3.30 to 4.30. Now it's 5 and we need to get ready to go to Shem and then we'll see what happens next. See where the night takes us. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we said that last night. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pick out an outfit o'clock. I might have to go into your closet. I just don't even know the vibe. These are cute. What is in there? My teddy. <laughs> I really like this top. It's cute. I don't know. We'll see. Oh, we could do a maxi skirt. I'm so genius. Okay, guys, we're going to be ready by 6.15. Mark our words. We need to take the curls, and I don't feel like dicing, so we're just going to touch it up with this. Or should we just not curl? Should we just see what it looks like brushed? Like, there's no really curls to touch up anymore. Guys, I can't touch up my curls because what is this? It does have volume, though. I could do a little clippy. <laughs> That'd be cute. I mean, curl it. Let's curl and see. What is Ryan's career? She, in between jobs. Yeah, but she used to be. I used to work at this company. No, called, she used to sell, um, I don't you know, I was it. trying to make up something. We're going to a bonfire tonight. I want to go to a bonfire. Guys, we're on TikTok live while we curl our hair. Guys, hair is done and now we're going to go do makeup. But we're on live, look. Hey, hi bloggy. Yeah, is anyone coming? To the garage sale. I'm stressed. What if nobody comes? Yes. Oh. Shit. What's that thing Ryan keeps saying in your vlog? Bombastic or Buster? Or both? Bombastic Buster Butterlock. 
Yeah, all of that. Guys, I feel my bathing too. Look at my necklace that Anna got me. She picked it out though. I just got her the gift card to get yeah. her started. Yeah, she's and look at my necklace that all you guys can get soon. Ryan does not live with us, but you you would think. You would think. But when she's not here, it feels like <laughs> like it does empty. Feel empty. <laughs> uh, mascara, just in case. You never know. You never know. Makeup brush. Final fit. This long dress because it's just so easy to just do a long dress. So cute. And then we have skirts. We have good vibes. Let's go get sunset. Let's go. I wish Ryan was more with us, and she could have scared me. No cookies in the cookie jar. We're gonna go to Shim Creek. We're trying to get the sunset. I tried saltwater cowboys. It was a frat function. It was very overwhelming. Like we, I tried to get in line at the bar, and then I was like, I'm about to have a panic attack, yeah, and we yeah. all said, Literally, let's get out of here. We put our name in for dinner, but we kind of want to just eat somewhere else. We're gonna go to Reds now to get a drink. Hey vlog. This is MK. Hey vlog. Vlog. This is my this is my brother. No, it's still recording. This is my brother. He went to the Citadel. If you know what that is, in Charleston, and he. How old are you? He's two years younger than me. All right, we left Reds. It was so super fun. We hung out with a lot of people. But now we came back to our apartment and we're about to go downtown. Are those the jeans? Your jeans? They're so slim. Your cute jeans. Your cute jeans. Girlfriend. Girlfriend? Girlfriend from Revolve. Excellent. And we got, I think we got like a 28, right? Yeah, yeah. Not like the perfect amount of low rise. Perfect, perfect. And she said they feel like sweatpants. they actually do their Use my commission like a link in below. Okay. Good morning, guys. Um, we had a really fun night last night. Share House was just so fun because I was just sipping. Like I said, I wanted to do. Like, I didn't want to get drunk. And you can still just have so much fun there with just sipping. So, highly recommend. But then towards the end, we were like, okay, we're not drunk. Let's get out of here. So, we did. Probably left like one or two. And then Red's was really fun, too. That's where we went first. It was like that rooftop with the couch. It was such a good couch area. We like couldn't get any food up there, which was very annoying, but it ended up being a super fun Saturday. And I'm so glad I didn't get hammered because I woke up Sunday. I feel great. Not great, but like I don't feel shitty. And that's good because my garage sale, or closet sale starts in two and a half hours and I gotta get over there. I just took um, two boxes and one trash can, one um, trash bag down. So now we just have two trash bags left. So when me and Ryan go down the final time, we'll both take one. And then that should be everything. They're in the back of the Jeep. I put the seats down, I'll show y'all. But at first I was nervous, nobody's gonna come. I still kinda am, but like I posted on TikTok and I think it reached a really good audience because there's so many people commenting and tagging their friends and it's almost at 200K. So hopefully that helped. I'm like excited to like meet people slash then my clothes for super cheap slash I don't know it'll be a fun little Sunday and we're doing brunch at Miss Melissa's house so I'll be like having brunch slash setting up. I'm gonna get Starbies on the way because your girl needs an extra venti. But I went outside to do the boxes and it's literally like so cold. It feels so good in like fall. I kind of want to wear Max, Alice, and Olivia overalls. I feel like that's the vibe for a clothing sale. And now that I'm getting more clothes, I can buy more clothes is my theory. I'm just kidding. We've done pretty good getting rid of stuff, I will say. So I'm gonna get ready and then we will spend this lovely, beautiful fall Sunday together. Guys, look at all these clothes. There's three, these three trash cans and two giant boxes behind. And I'm gonna try and close Stargirl. Okay, car is loaded and we're gonna go get Starbies. It's gonna be great. Okay, I didn't find where the Starbucks drive through one is. I know there's one in Mount Pleasant, but whatever. So I went in and I got my iced brown sugar shaken espresso with oat milk, blonde espresso, one pump of brown sugar, four pumps of sugar-free vanilla, one pump of pumpkin. Do you always get pumpkin or is it? No. For fall. Chef's kiss, man. And, uh, we don't have to tell anyone about that. We can tell Floyd. But like, y'all. I wish I had a picture of it in the street. I literally... The camera was just sitting in the middle of the road, and it was like, wait, I think I left Floggy on top of the car. <laughs> Again! But this time was worse, bro. It was just sitting. She goes, I think I heard something fall off, and then a car just runs it over, and it's in the middle but of the car. But it was in the middle of the car, like it didn't <laughs> hit the tires. That was insane. Hey, I just dropped Floggy. I had it on the car. This is the second time you did that in like a week. Yeah, but it, it felt 
it, at the gate, it fell on the road, and we ran back, and we watched a car run it over, but the yeah. wheels are on either side. Did of you it. get it? Yeah, she's right here, and oh she's working. <laughs> Wait, we need to like set up. I'm like stressed out. Gotta eat. Okay. We're gonna eat and then set up. Okay. Yes. What are you gonna do to like stop this from happening? <laughs> She's lecturing me on bloggy falling like, off my car. I've got to stop placing it. Please, this is so I'm cute. We're getting, um, bloggy. Bloggy on your car. On, there's got to be some sort of alarm. There's got to be another way. You've got another way that air tag, honestly. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to be checking my air tag when I get back in my car. Well, mine is so sensitive that it says when I'm that far apart from it, it says you left your air tag. No, no way. Did you guys stay out late? No, we kind of called it an early night. Yeah, I checked on y'all. I could see Mackenzie was home at like 1045. Cause I no had to, way, we were only at 1045, we good. Yeah, I had to take- We were home at 1045. 1045 told me we went home to pregame to go back oh, to the chair. Uh, <laughs> oh, you tricked me. I thought she The way Ryan me. believed that too. <laughs> I was like, wait, that's so early, good for us. No. Alexa, next song. Wait, no, you have to see Ryan dancing. Last night, like, she did it back. I think we have a 12 pack. It's just like, from how hard I don't laugh. know why. She wasn't even like drunk, like watch. <laughs> <laughs> What's her even music? I don't even know. Like oh, there it is. <laughs> wow. No, I'm not kidding for three hours straight. Me and Mac were hurting. No wonder. No, wait, you're watch so this skinny. one, watch this one. It's a workout. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> um, I love it. You guys just slapped her. You didn't dance with her. You guys want to eat? Yeah, I know. Right there. Crazy girl. Venmo. If anyone wants to Venmo, we provide. Alright. Yeah. We'll cut this. I made so, like a little table tent, but we really don't have a table. So I'm just going to tape these like on the, on the uh, rack. And on the tent. Can you like as many like oh, if you have any more like towels or like, like just stuff to get that stuff out of Oh I have so many beach towels. Yeah. yeah. I think that's the only way. Let's do beach towels and then and I have a tarp. Yeah, you have a map. So what did they should say like I was, I was gonna put Oh like all together on the sail and then arrow. Because it needs to be big. Like this way, closet, sail, yeah. this way. Yeah, and we'll take this to here and then we'll put this up. That's all we need, right? Right. Did I just hear the stove? <laughs> oh, I did. Uh -oh. That was good ears. That's bad. We should use the cars to be like $5, $10, $15. Oh, and now? Are you riding the bike? I want to go see Adele. And um, there you go. Perfect. You also try to go into something in the sphere. I did like 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Ask Anna. Guys, we have so much to do and it starts in 30 minutes and we're really stressed. Like we haven't set anything up and we think people are here. Look at the line for Anna. <laughs> okay, just so you know, yeah, you know. <laughs> like literally. You know, somebody gave us back, or he's missing, but like. Okay, just make sure you're gonna be waiting a while. I'm going to see Taylor twice in Sweden, <laughs> and I want that dress. <laughs> yeah, she's been talking about literally the wearing morning. Speak Now. Like, Wait, Anna. Who do I sell that Speak Now? You're never gonna wear it ever again. <laughs> Wait, I don't want to see it. It's happening. It's happening. It's happening. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so dramatic for no reason. Okay. I'm so excited for you. Oh my god. Oh. You got like the stable. Oh. Wait, right, take a photo of us. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I've got to grab. Wait. Oh, this is so cute. Oh my god. I love that. It couldn't have gone to a more perfect person. No, seriously. Yeah, I've been good here. Oh You're going to look so perfect. <laughs> oh, <shit. That's> <laughs> Dude, that's oh perfect. All the outfit is gonna be perfect. 
And she's in the song, and then she's. Okay, okay. You're so cute. I'm so excited. Okay, let me do this. You have to send me for you. Yes, I will. I will. I literally saw Grace last night and we were out. Yeah. <laughs> and I dropped her drink all over the floor. <laughs> and I had to get her another one. We were going crazy dummy. <laughs> Look at the line for Anna. Thank God, Busters. Well, We've are. been waiting on this one. <laughs> We've been waiting. <laughs> Literally, meet and greet. Hey, of course, you guys live here. Yeah, yeah we're, um, I'm actually originally from here, so I've been here my whole life. So <laughs> lucky you. It's perfect here. Okay, buggy. <laughs> Guys, this is crazy. There are so many people that showed up. It's just now 12 and all the clothes are gone. <laughs> so we were like, like, is to, this it? And we're like, yeah. I'd like to give an official apology to all <laughs> who came. We also caused a traffic jam in my family's neighborhood. <laughs> so no, hopefully my mom doesn't get in trouble. <laughs> 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 Like, now all the Why do these have springs on them? Can you buy them? <laughs> um, you know I don't have any money. Like, can everyone make yeah, friends in Y'all, who wants to buy them? <laughs> oh. <laughs> the moms came through! <laughs> the moms came through! <laughs> I can't believe this. Hi. <laughs> No. no clothes, no clothes left. And we were in so much traffic. <laughs> this is what we have left. This is it. A couple bras. Like, this is it. Y'all, everyone took everything. Like, what is this? And I'm like, it's our shitty neighborhood. What are you talking about? It's the same way it looks every day. Guys, literally look the, at the old lady. Like, like, we had done that. So the old lady had to shove. To before, I, and that's why and, I turned and around. Then, and she was like, we well, are blocking the old neighborhood. And I go, I'm sorry. Okay, vloggy, I feel like you're going to die in five seconds. Um, after the clothing sale, you kind of died. So I didn't really get to catch you guys up and talk about it. But we were so, like, just exhausted from how the chaos, like, I didn't, none of us expected. We knew it'd be crazy, but like, I was lucky. Like, I don't know if people are gonna come. Like, I don't know. Like, people are probably busy. Like, I don't know how much people are reached. Like, whatever. Cause, like, not a lot of people were swiping up on Instagram, but I guess TikTok, it really hit the target audience and girls told their friends. Supporting people, I don't know, but like, guys, it, we were, somebody said they got there 20 minutes before it started and everything was pretty much gone. Like, we were just having brunch because Miss Melissa makes this brunch every Sunday. And then I started to get a little worried. I was like, maybe we should go set up. So we went to go set up at like 11 30, 40. And there were already girls there. And they saw us and got out of their car and came. And so we didn't we were gonna set up something really cute, but we didn't have time. People were going through the boxes, but everyone was so nice and respectful. So I was like, okay, you know what? Everyone just go through the box. Cause I was gonna have signs being like five, 10, 15. I was like, no. <laughs> everyone just go through the boxes, come to me, it'll be great. Let's go. And we did it. I started saying like Mac, I started delegating my tasks. Nursing, if you know, you know. I was like, Mac, Ryan, all y'all just make up your own prices. Whatever it is, I'll be good with it. And Miss Melissa was doing the same. She was like, you need to be charging more. Cause I was, girls were really coming up to me and they're like, are you sure for all this? And I was like, no girls, I just want you guys to have the clothes. I just want to get rid of them, sell them for cheap. I told y'all it was going to be super affordable. So I'm so excited and I can't wait. I'm like, maybe I'll just see y'all around town in my little clothes. But it went so well and literally there was a line and I thought the whole line was just to check out, but the line was to meet me. And I was like, what? It's like people are actually staying in this heat because they want to meet me. Like that did it. It just really meant a lot to me actually because I feel like I've been getting a lot of hate on the internet lately. And it's kind of been getting to me and like seeing you guys and how genuine and amazing these people were in person and how sweet and kind and the nice things they had to say and like telling me that I inspired them and nursing and stuff like that. It just really like kept me going and like relit my passion for this and I just really needed it. So just know you guys inspire me just as much as I inspire you. So that meant everything. The girl who got my Speak Now dress, I'm obsessed with and it made me so happy I wasn't even gonna sell it. And I saw her and she was getting teary eyed and like not like she didn't 
didn't pressure me all to give it but like i just felt like it was a god thing like i felt like it was the right thing to do to give it to her and i'm so excited i can't wait to see her wear it and long live was playing like it was just a crazy coincidence of everything it was so cool and then after the clothing sale I gave Mac and Ryan money. I was like, guys, you guys helped so much. I don't even know how much I made. I don't even care how much I made. It was just so fun to meet you guys. Such a fun thing to do on a Sunday. We all just poured some mimosas and just laid down and we're like, what the fuck just happened? Because, oh, I didn't even explain to you guys. So at the end, she lives in like these super nice houses. So like it, it's a bunch of like older ladies. So this older lady came in with her dog and was like, who's in charge? What is going on? I've never seen something like this. What, what is going on? And I was like, I was too busy talking to all the girls. And so Ryan was like, what? Like, she's like, this is ridiculous. Like, you guys can't be doing this. Like, this is private property. Like, da da da. And we were like, well, so she came up to me and she was like, are you the famous one? And I was like, what? And she was like, well, you don't belong here. And I was like, what? And, and Ryan said, well, what are you doing today? Like, why is this bothering you so much? It's one hour. Like, what are you doing today? And she said, that's none of your fucking business. Like, y'all. And then Miss Melissa, like, talked to her, calmed her down, and we flipped her because we gotta stay on her good side because they're literally neighbors, and I didn't want Miss Melissa to get fined, but she threatened to call the cops to start directing traffic. Like, I'm not kidding. Insert this video of the cars piled up, like, <laughs> not piled up, but, like, in line. Like, we shut down this road to solo events. Like, somebody was like, I was trying to get to the beach, and I couldn't. Like, we had no idea. So next time we do this, I think... But it ended good and we got her, I was like, I'm so sorry, man. Like, I'm so sorry. And she was like, just learn from this next time. And I was like, learn from what? And it, it got to the point where she was like yelling at the people, the girls in line. Like she was yelling at my fans. And I was like, don't talk to them like that. Like, absolutely not. And there was a girl, if you're her, I didn't get to meet her, but she, you were standing with Miss Melissa for like 30 minutes. And she said like, you had her back and were like defending me and be like, she's actually doing a lot of good for the community. I didn't get to meet you. If I didn't, I'm so sorry. Please DM me because Miss Melissa wants to talk to you. She was obsessed with you. So I love you for having my back. I'm so sorry if you guys came and didn't get anything. I apologize. I had no idea it'd be gone by 12. That kind of is unfair to people who came during the time period, but we had no choice to shut it down. But it makes me like want to do more events like that. Now that I know people will come, and we can make it more organized for sure. For sure, for sure, for sure, for sure. So let me know if that'd be something y'all would be interested in. But it was a really good day. We watched some Sunday football. I fell asleep napping on the couch, and then we went out on the patio, had some girl time, and it was just a really, really happy Sunday. I loved it a lot, and I'm just so thankful. Insert video footage of the clips you guys missed from the second half of the day since Loggy died. But yeah, so Max slept there. We were gonna sleep there. I need to start packing a bag, but I kind of want to get my life together tomorrow morning and like work out and like I didn't have to change the clothes or my makeup wipes or whatever. So we can go back. But Miss Melissa sent me home with salmon and vegetables, and I'm so excited because everywhere I wanted to go was closed and I wanted a healthy meal. So I'm so excited. Yes, it was Ryan apparently. Um, yeah. We're having another sleepy. We're gonna watch. I said, okay, Ryan, but we have to watch. Oh my God. We have to watch Southern Charm. And she said, absolutely not. And I said, wait, I literally thought you were on FaceTime. So no, I was trying to vlog you the whole time. Let me tell my dad I love him. Oh, I've been drinking mimosas since. All, since she's been drinking since Thursday. <laughs> Probably. Love you all. No, I have. It was such a good day, I couldn't have done it without Ryan and Mac and Miss Melissa. It was such a slay. I'm so glad today happened. Slay! I thought you were on pizza and Mac. Blake. Why would I be telling Mac everything that happened? I don't know. I didn't hear you after it. Yeah, so I'm going to end this weekend vlog. This was a fun ass weekend. And see, this, I just know here, like, it's okay if I don't have plans, stuff happens. Like, we only had plans. What did we do Friday? Oh, oh, the wind jammer. Wind jammer. Oh. Would love to forget Friday, but just kidding. No, it was a really fun night. But now I'm gonna. Oh, this is hot. My salmon veggies. We're gonna watch the Kardashians. And I love you guys. Thanks so much for watching. And we're gonna start this week in my life. And yeah, love y'all.